don't even remember which this boss is. Now I remember. My usual thing of ignoring democracy? I don't usually ignore democracy. I ignore democracy when it's inconvenient. When it correctly chooses the right option, we go with it. Today, either option was correct. Sometimes, some options are not equally correct. It's like, have you ever had a multiple choice question uh, test where one of the answers is clearly, clearly designed as like a bait answer? It's in there because it's clear that someone who knows what they're talking about wouldn't select that, but someone who had only kind of maybe like scanned the material they're supposed to have memorized and studied would like think that might be related and might vote for it. It's kind of like that when I put up polls. Sometimes there's a wrong answer and sometimes chat votes for it and I can't help them. You guys understand. But here we are. I guess I should update this because this is not Darkest Dungeon. Hold on a second. There's never any hope for Warhammer? Sure there was. There were three votes away from making Warhammer there. I'm frowny face because uh, democracy failed you. Literally how democracy works. People vote, they disagree. Some people get reamed. Missions available. If I remember correctly, yeah, we got short and medium unlocked. We can go for long. All right. Let me remember how this game works. Yes, these things shoot arrows at me. Don't get hit. Okay. And these things have extremely long range for some reason. Doing work for me. Oh no! Fuck, just rolled into that. Rolled the wrong way. Alright, what do we get? We got max health and damage for blood. Yes. Dodging these traps a little bit better than the first time we were in this area. wondering if I was about to get slapped. Got hit by that stupid bug. It was bad. All right, what do we want? Weakened enemies with the spear. I mean, we do have a spear. I don't think all spears weaken though. This one does. Thanks, man. Um, five percent of critical hit heals you is not bad, but it's con. Con's pretty unexciting. Minus ten percent gold offering cost and dex. I think we're gonna roll for a better one. Perception. Six percent HP regen through doors is pretty good. It might be good enough to just take. All right, let's buy that with blood. Give ourselves a way to heal. Picked up our first curse from two blood purchases and going for a weapon. Kind of, yeah, possible fudge in I gotta figure out what I wanna do for the next round of uh, YouTube videos. One of your relic slots is locked and may no longer be equipped. You gain three divine, divine favors. I don't know what a fucking divine favor is. What is a divine favor in this game? Oh, rerolls. Ah, nice. Thanks. Just hit me. It is avoidable, the spin. Even when I'm that close, kind of kind of feels bad. Get pretty sick. Um, 
can get pretty sick greed kills off this fight if you don't get hit. This guy hit there, lost my 10 streak. This weapon hits like a small child. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Kincaid, if you know how to get good fucking internet in Iowa, you let me know, because uh, I am losing that fight. Two relics, or another roll at a weapon. We'll go relics. All the bosses in the Snake Temple are weak against parry. It's good to know. You know what else is weak? Parry. I'm weak against parry as well. It's a hard button to find to find the timing on. Much in the way of greed kills here. They don't have huge rewards stuck to greed kills either, though, so it's not that big a deal. Dark swiftness. Dodging makes you intangible with an increased dodging window. Perfect dodgers no longer regenerate stamina. Bad. I like perfect dodging. Do a lot of them accidentally. Oh, I'm hitting him with my fucking. Oh, dude, I thought that was my claw and it was my sword. Or my. Not my sword, my. Porch. Hmm. Stamina becomes a pretty important attribute. It really defines how far you can uh, attack, basically, before dealt with. Do shit like that. And then pick this up. For that one. Ah, got it to swap from perception to uh, dex. Fantastic. My weapon scales off dex. It is a 20% chance to inflict fire. That's why sometimes it, uh, sometimes they light up. You are correct. I've forgotten that it was on there. All right, first boss. Three curses. Taking damage triggers a wave of blackness. Oh no! Don't do that to me, boss! Hard to avoid with this claw, I gotta say. I'm too close all of the time. I think we'll take the boss, but I think we'll set ourselves up pretty poorly for after this. What is that shit? He just like lets off like 12 bombs that all insta spawn and start doing damage. Feels pretty bad. He rotates if you dodge behind him when he's launching that too. This is in light here. I wish I could figure out a way to get the light source out of his base. 
All right, got there, but it feels bad. I like Bullet Hell. I think Bullet Hell is actually a very fun mechanic on this, but it's he's better fought with a weapon with more range than claws. Claws are as close and personal as you can get. All right, chat, I'm back. So that's that was a kind of unfortunate coincidence there. So, you know, guys, you guys know I'm having internet issues, right? So my wife just logged into a Zoom call, and I'm like, I was just suddenly wondering if like the upload from that was what was causing this, but. We just tested having her log out of the Zoom call again and logging back in. It doesn't seem to have actually been related to that. It's just like a really bad spike at exactly the moment she logged into that. It's kind of strange. I really like to get this taken care of. Modem and router in the mail, on their way. Fingers crossed. Build run or parry run? Neither, it's a claw run. Shields are parry. Although, I would love to do a pure shield run. Alright, what is this? Two-handed spear. A dark repost occurs after a successful parry. No thanks. Alright, let's try that. Gold. I like those events. I believe. Optimistic. <laughs> you just fucking hit me twice. Runs over. Just stop believing yet. I run through some traps. No problem. Don't need that health. Surplus. No. I get that third swing for fucking healing, but I can walk in like this. Uh, damage and gold find for gold, yes. Quite a lot of damage and gold fun right now. Another unknown. If I get a heal, that would be really good. Max healing for 84 there. What's the curse? Shadow Flame. I don't remember which one this is. Okay. Fine. It's another non non issue curse. But I gotta fight a boss with 179 health, which I don't think is realistic. Oh, it's not a boss yet. Hoping I could knock that light out. That guy to hit it, I guess. It's a weapon. Deals critical damage against elite champions and bosses. The light shit on fire. It's heal us though. It debuffs all of our damage. It debuffs our darkness damage off of the weapon and our darkness damage off our rune. But I kind of feel like we're going to die if we don't heal. I think we're going to try it. It's a worse weapon overall, but I can't beat this boss if I don't get something. 
don't even remember which this boss is. Now I remember. Oh! <laughs> I remember him doing like a point blank slashing attack. That was so anticlimactic. I don't remember him doing a, uh, a long range beam attack. Feels bad. Yeah. Fine. That went well. Yeah. Not wrong. <laughs> 